Of all the game consoles I've owned, the Sega Saturn is easily one of my favorites. However, collecting games for this console is not cheap at all. And there's a few reasons for that, which I'll talk about later. But if your heart is still set on buying a Sega Saturn, you've come to the right place. So today I'm going to show you a few cost-saving methods that will allow you to get the most enjoyable experience out of your Sega Saturn. In North America, Sega released the Saturn back in 1995, only a few months before the Sony PlayStation and a full year before the Nintendo 64. But while those two consoles sold well, the Saturn... Eh, not so much. As a result, there just weren't that many games being released for the Saturn. So, most North American Saturn games are now high price collectibles. But hey, that was over 20 years ago. I can just emulate the Saturn on my PC, right? Well, yeah, but even the best Sega Saturn emulators are prone to crashing and are surprisingly incompatible with a lot of games. Now, remember when I said the Saturn sold horribly in North America? Well, that wasn't the case in Japan because the Saturn was extremely popular there. You can still find plenty of Japanese Saturn games for sale, and the vast majority of them are really inexpensive. I actually own more Japanese Saturn games than I do North American ones. Most of the really fun games don't require you to read Japanese, so that's even more reason to buy imports. I have a lot of import games, so it was just easier for me to own a Japanese Saturn. Now, regardless of what Saturn you own, you're gonna need one of these. This is an action replay cartridge. So, what it does is that it allows you to unlock the region settings on your Saturn. For example, uh, I have the American release of Dragon Force, but I own a Japanese Sega Saturn, so I can't play it. But as long as I have an action replay cartridge, I can play my American Saturn games on this console. The reverse is also true, so if you're looking to import Japanese games for your American or European Sega Saturn, just get an action replay and you're good to go. Pseudo Saturn is a more recent development, but arguably the most cost effective. Basically, it's a program that allows you to bypass the security settings and play burned CDs on your Sega Saturn. Historically, you would have to open up the console and install a mod chip, or do something called the swap trick, which I don't recommend. Both of those would allow you to play burned discs. However, with Pseudo Saturn, you just install the program on either a Saturn memory card or an action replay cartridge, and that's it. So technically speaking, as long as you have a cartridge with Pseudo Saturn installed on it, you'll never have to buy another Sega Saturn game. But I mostly just use it for some of the more expensive games. Good example, the American release of Burning Rangers is worth several hundred dollars nowadays. So instead, I just downloaded the game, burned it to a disc, and with Pseudo Saturn, my problem is solved. I've gone ahead and posted a tutorial link below that tells you how to install Pseudo Saturn, but if you're lazy like me, you can just buy a cartridge with Pseudo Saturn already installed. I bought this one from Retro Gamers and Backups. Now, I realize a lot of retro gamers out there want nothing to do with burned CDs, and that's fine. I like having the original game discs as well, and I have plenty of them. But without Pseudo Saturn, I wouldn't have been able to play this game right here, Police Knots. It's by Hideo Kojima, you know, the guy who did Metal Gear Solid. But this game is entirely in Japanese. So earlier this year, there was an English patch released for the game. So I was actually able to buy an original copy of Police Knots, patch it, and burn a new version of the game to a CD. Now, let me show you how Pseudo Saturn works. And I've got my old school CRTV set up here just for fun. The console starts up like normal, but then it boots the Pseudo Saturn program. And once that boots, all you have to do is select Start Game, and the console starts reading the burn CD. It's really that easy. With an action replay cartridge and Pseudo Saturn, you're not only saving yourself a lot of money, but you are unlocking the full potential of your Sega Saturn, and I've got nothing against that. Anyways, I hope this video has been helpful and lets you experience everything the Sega Saturn has to offer, all without breaking the bank.